results for contests. Updates and features. We've gone over things like those shoes right there that you can see. We go over shows and talk about the show creators as new shows are launching. We want to keep it on top of mind so that you know exactly what to look forward to. And we've been known on occasion to announce a new top badge or something like that. That happens every now and again too here. So if you're locked in, you're tuned in for it, thank you for coming. Again, this is every Friday at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm going to send out a blast from my personal account. My personal account's Chris Casper. So we're going to go ahead and go to that Favorites tab, hit that Fans, and select The Rundown is... It's one word. Rundown is live. And we're going to do all capital because it's exciting, right? It's exciting. Here we go. Hi, everyone. Thanks for coming to The Rundown. Quick shout-out to a couple other shows that have recently premiered, want to keep top of mind. Wednesdays at 7 p.m., you've got Before and After with Aaron Kirby. Aaron Kirby is uh, a host with a lot of talent, but he has coaches with a little bit more talent. Nah. <laughs> he has some very talented hosts, uh, a co-host uh, co who, uh, who come on, and they help coach up talent for a before performance and an after performance. Make sure you check that out every Wednesday at 7. We have the Music Box Showcase. Uh, it's titled the Music Box Showcase. You just have to search that to find it. Very unique viewing experience. Uses something called OBS to plug in a lot of camera angles and there's scene transitions. It's a really good time. Make sure you check out the Music Box Showcase every Thursday at 7. Thursdays at 9. We had a lot of stuff for premiere recently. Thursdays at 9, it's Sippin' Celebrity with Mercedes. With Mercedes. Mercedes has the hottest gossip. If you're into Hollywood news, breaking info, she's got the scoop, and she wants your opinion. So make sure you check out Mercedes every Thursday. And recently, as of two weeks ago, we have Love Quest with Blake Premier and Dr. Morgan. You'll search for Blake Premier's live stream if you want to find that one. We just had them on last week. We had them on the rundown last week to talk a little bit about their show. It's a guru forum, everyone. If your heart aches, if you're looking for love, if you're curious why you can't find love, or what tips you can take to get closer to working something out with a significant other, make sure that you check out Love Quest every Thursday at 10. Later on in the show today, we're going to have the host of Gore Couture, Carmen San Diego, come on to talk about what she's doing special the month of October since she has a makeup effects show. She's got something special to show. Uh, normally I don't acknowledge comments, but someone said badge, stay fresh. Uh, we just badge uh, role model fresh. That's what I was getting confused. I'm like, didn't we just do that? <laughs> uh, but yeah, congratulations, See, which is my next announcement. Uh, congratulations to last week's, last week's uh, top badge announcements. We had Wildfire and Role Model Fresh get their top badges. Rumor has it that there's another top badge being given out tonight. Today? To now. To now is, to now is the time, right? Okay, so now we're gonna announce another top badge, everyone. Before that, though, let's go over some contest results. Last week, we had the uh, cocktail contest. I love it when we have those unique contests that are broken down uh, through gifting. That's different, a little bit different. Not just the top gifts, but it matters what type of unique gifts you get. So we're going to go over some of the uh, place placements of that and how that broke down. So for your cocktail party, going over that top ten, top uh, top eight, top eight. We'll go over top eight here. Abby Scott placement, uh, two million five hundred and seventy nine thousand for Abby Scott. Coming in seventh place was Geo with two million. 685,000. We had in sixth place Panic with 2,900,000. Holy smokes. Holly coming in in fifth place with 3,207,000. We have in fourth place Sean Rain with 3,535,000. Your top three for the cocktail party. Last week's contest, everyone. Top three coming in third place. The one and only, not vodka with four million five hundred and seventeen thousand diamonds. Second place uh, for your cocktail party contest last week, Mr. Bob with five million two hundred and fifty-eight thousand. <sighs> coming in with another W. You got to know her name by now. Everybody knows. Vivi knows. Vivi knows with that number one place in the, at five point. Four million diamonds. Congratulations, Vivi, for another 
win. Chalking up another W there. All right. Uh, but the fun doesn't stop, everyone, because there's another contest hanging out this weekend. We have the epic weekend contest happening. First place is taking home a cool 1.4 million diamonds. Pay out the top 60. There's been a lot of spots for placement lately, everyone. A lot of spots for placement. So if you're thinking, you know, I, I want to see how I can do in one of these contests, now's your chance because there's 60 spots open. And if any of you know a hairdresser with a spot that's open, I could use it. <laughs> so send me their number. All right. What else is going on? What else do we have going on? Hey, the contests are happening. How can you help your favorites win in this contest? Obviously, there's new gifts to help you out with that. There's the fall leaves to get in the spirit of everything that's going on. The fall leaves are happening. There they are right there. Uh, and arguably more exciting is the new futuristic mystery wheel. There's four prizes on it. You've got the Robo Boogie. It's a little dancing guy. you got the Astronaut. Rocket Man, which I've had good luck with. I've spun about seven wheels and hit three Rocket Men. I gotta say, that's really good. That's a really good odds. And then final, final grand prize, right? Time Traveler. Time Traveler taking to uh, back or forward to the future or something like that, right? The Time Traveler gift coming at you with the grand total of 120K. 120K on that. So if you want to try your luck out, we you know you love those mystery wheels. Try your luck out and see what you can land on with your favorite streamer. Maybe help someone place in a contest this weekend. All right, Carmen San Diego, are you in the building right now? Because I think we have a show to talk about. We have a show to talk about. So for those of you who don't know, before Carmen comes in here, go ahead and request that box if you can. Carmen has been a longtime show host of a show called Gore Couture. Gore Couture uh, obviously stars Carmen San Diego. She is a makeup effects artist that wants to help you put on some festive looks. And she's here to talk a little bit more about what she's doing this month for the month of October. So Carmen, how's it going? Hello. Good, how are you? Oh, I'm doing well, I'm doing well. Thanks for joining us. I always uh, get nervous when I'm in somebody's box. I don't know why. Ah, it's, it's different, right? You go from- It is very different. This. Oh, thank you, whoever did that. <laughs> Carmen, uh, what is, I know I just touched on what your show's about, but can you, in your own words, tell us about your show and, and what you're doing this month? Okay, so my show is mostly gore and special effects makeup. Um, I have done, I've been a freelancer for years, and after doing that, like proms and weddings and stuff, I taught myself how to do special effects makeup. I've worked at haunted houses, and I've been doing my gore couture since June of last year. So a little about a year and four months on Meet Me every Thursday. Wow. What was the look that you did last night? Uh, last night I did a pumpkin on one side, and it was like a ripped open face. And on the other side was just like a orange kind of smoky eye with a lot of blood and fake skin and, you know, that's kind of the stuff. You I know, the look, the look when you're going to a grocery store. When you're going to a grocery store, you got to get your pumpkin face if you want to, if you want to jump back in the box, Carmen. You got to get the pumpkin attire on. You got to get bag of, a uh, bag of bread. Does bread come in a bag? A bread bag? Okay. That seems weird to say. Bread box? A bread package. Go get your bread package. There's so much going on. Is that how that <laughs> happens? It's There's a, so much happening right now. I don't know how you do it. Uh, my not, anxiety right, right now. Carmen, <laughs> Carmen uh, what time is your show? We said it was last night, but what time is it? Um, it's about 8 o'clock. It, well, it's at 8 o'clock Eastern time. I usually give a little bit of time for people to come in and start the makeup anywhere from about 8.15 to 8.30. Okay, okay. So. Uh, if people want to follow along, you obviously take them step by step through it. Can you possibly tease what next week's look is? Okay, so I have a couple of ideas of what I'm going to be doing for the month of October. Mm. Um, They're that secret, too. The looks are so secret that she needs time to think about it, and she's going to come back and let us know. But, okay, okay, here we go. Car Carmen, she's made up her mind. She's made up her mind. We know, we know what we're going to do. All right, Car Carmen, go ahead and re-request the box. I saw that you'd, it goes there. Everyone, if you're tuning in just now, by the way, welcome to The Rundown. This is a show we do every Friday at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We talk to you about the contest results, new gifts, announcements, 
New top badges as well as shows. Carmen, go fast. <laughs> okay, so for this month, I'm thinking about doing, um, I've been wanting to do for a while this like snake look where there's actually going to be like my skin that's going to be shed off that's going to still kind of be attached to me on me and i'm going to have like a snake print and then the attached skin of my face i don't know how else to explain it um i was thinking about doing this really cool like spider with the fan it's a spider uh well <laughs> We'll leave it at that. Carmen, if you could make some comments in the chat so people can favor you. If you have not favorited Carmen, if you have not favorited Carmen, please do. We got a little taste. Of that. I, hate, I hate to keep having you jump in and out, Carmen. Thank you so much for doing that. There she is. She's with the laughing emojis. She's with the laughing emojis, everyone. Uh, please, please go ahead and check out Gore Couture with Carmen San Diego every Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. All right. Today is not a long show, everyone. Today is not a long show. We, uh, we had talked about last week's top badges, Role Model Fresh and Wildfire. The week prior to that, Mala received her top badge. We have a new top badge to announce this week. Special shout out to Fake Streamer being named Streamer of the Week. Congratulations to her. So if you see her, make sure you drop by. And if you want to keep up on the updates of who's getting Streamer of the Week, contest announcements, new and special events, or just looking for an inspirational quote to throw up on your... Well, uh, check out the Meet Me official or the Meet Me app official Instagram page as well as the tagged and scout official Instagram pages. That's where you can get all that great information. Okay, on that note, let's get to that top badge announcement. They say in order to be a top streamer, you have to do you have to do some things and some things that would normally have someone be famous. Uh, you could even argue that top streamers are some of the most famous people on the app. But what happens if they're infamous? I don't know. I guess we're going to have to ask him. Mr. Infamous, congratulations. You have earned your top badge. Please request that box. Mr. Infamous, congratulations. You have earned your top badge Let's go. how are you doing sir good brother happy friday what up everybody happy friday to you how are you feeling doing wonderful man i'm super thrilled and excited to earn my top badge happy friday indeed i, I can only imagine uh well i i can't imagine actually <laughs> but <Let's go>. yeah <laughs> but mr infamous let's yes, Let's jump into a little bit of an introduction uh, so that all the viewers can get to know who you are and possibly get a little taste of what you are most infamous for. Most definitely. So what's up, everybody? Congrats to all of the family. I want to say I want to accept this top badge on behalf of everyone who comes and hangs out with me. My name is Mr. Infamous, and I'm content-based. My stream is, is once to twice a day. I'm sure he's going to ask me. You can always find me on in the evenings around 8 to 9 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. And in my stream, it's all based on content, having fun, making music, making improvisation, making people laugh, being hilarious, being over the top, and just trying to really bring a quality show to everybody. And I'm so thrilled to earn my top badge today. I can't believe it. Yeah. Uh, anyone who's spent any amount of time in your live stream, this doesn't come as a surprise. Uh, I would argue one of the most talented people on the platform in more ways than one. Uh, an excellent example of a streamer as well, of, oh, thank of you, man. a way to conduct yourself. So, Mr. Infamous, how long have you been streaming for? Well, thank you so much for that. Um, I started on May 16th. That's wow. My streaming journey began. May 16th, and you just dove right into it. You have, a, you have a little bit of a perform performance background besides live streaming, correct? Most definitely, yes. I've been always kind of performing and doing different various things, so kind of bring a lot of that to the streaming element. Awesome. What's up, everybody? We did it, uh, Edge, baby. You happen to have a guitar handy? I do. I'm probably. I mean, yeah. Let's go. You want to have a party? <laughs> so, everyone, if you have not yet, please give Mr. Infamous a favorite. He is your newest top badge. Let's go have a little demo of what they can expect to see should they join. Most definitely. I'm about to go celebrate right now, guys. I just want to thank sincerely from the bottom of my heart all the people that come to my room every day, um, all the people that have advocated for me. You guys know who you are. I'll be sure to come and thank you and um, look forward to continuing to create great content here on Meet Me for 
years to come. I'm so delighted to have a top badge and represent the Meet Me family. Let's go. So it's a Friday. We pulled up to earn the top badge. People are like, who is Mr. Infamous? He got that swag. You already know. All you got to do is come to my show. You know it's definitely bound to be so dope. And now you say, they're like, damn, who's this rapper? You know I'm just hanging out here with Chris Casper. Having fun and we hanging out. Got that tap badge now, so look at me shine how. How am I going to do it? They already know. All you got to do is come around to my show. Yo, a pro when it comes to definitely freestyle. And look at all these comments are going super wild and hello I see all of my friends that's the truth hard to read all of the comments But I'm gonna have to do my best I can I better fucking speed it up a bit Oh my god I cuss because I am excited I am delighted to join the meet me family Get my top match yo come and watch me stream This is not an advertisement This is just me wilding out right now because I'm excited Look at all the flames Look at Chris Casper with a smile on his face This is gonna be a great day Everybody have a good weekend and come and celebrate if you really Need it. You know what if I'm me, I'm gonna be in my room doing what I do Celebrating the top bench, so definitely come through Before I go, one thing you need to know If you're ever feeling down, just come to my show Talk to me, tell me all of your feelings And I'm willing to listen to you and boost you up Boost your morale, that's what we do now So now I'm out to roll out, y'all can say wow Hey, Mr. Infamous, thank you so much Congratulations on the top badge. If you have not dropped the favorite, please do. Newest announcement. Congratulations, Thank my friend. Thank you so, so much. Definitely. Happy Friday. Let's go. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Everybody, that's the announcements for today. That's the announcements for today. Congratulations to Mr. Infamous. Congratulations to Role Model Fresh and Wildfire, your new top badges of last week. Even before that was Molly. Uh, streamer of the week, fake streamer. Be sure to participate in the epic weekend, as well as congratulations again to those cocktail party winners. Everyone, I'm Chris Casper. Thank you so much for joining. We'll be back here again Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Enjoy the weekend. We'll see you later. All right. Bye, everyone.